your running back, Robin Fenty, is is uh, getting some NFL looks and possibly could be a, another Lafayette alum to reach the NFL. What are your thoughts on that? I didn't know that, but that's so awesome. Good for him. I wish. That's awesome. Good for him. You, would you see yourself buying a Robin Fenty jersey? Um, sure. Is he he's really good? Yeah, he's putting up pretty some pretty ridiculous numbers this season. Well, if they're ridiculous numbers, then yes, absolutely. Nick Shafniski has been pretty good this year. He ranks pretty sure top 10 in the country in rushing as of right now. What are your thoughts on him? That's the quarterback's brother, right? Yeah, yeah okay. Uh, don't know much about him either, but uh, I think we'll be able to stop him. Um, you know, Calvin Harris, he's been a, a star player for the Leopards this year, mm -hmm. um, out of nowhere, really. What are your thoughts on how he can, you know, help uh, the Leopards take down Lehigh? What position does he play? <laughs> he's uh, running back. Oh, he's Wait. running back? Okay, okay well then our... Not the, not the artist. Oh, oh, I know, I know. <laughs> <laughs> I think that that was just, you know, the beginning, and now they're really gonna pick it up, and he's just gonna run all the way. At least three touchdowns, I'm feeling. Dwayne Johnson's been a pretty uh, good wide receiver for Lafayette this year. He's putting up some ridiculous numbers. Um, may possibly uh, make it to the NFL. What are your thoughts on um, a possible Lafayette alum in the NFL? That'd be pretty cool. Yeah, that would be cool. I'd be looking forward to that. <laughs> <laughs> looking forward to it. I disagree with what she said. <laughs> It'd just be cool. I wouldn't be looking forward to it. Lehigh is in first place right now. Um, their linebacker, Aubrey Graham, he guaranteed a win in week one, saying the Laf Lafayette will lose by 23, I believe, was the margin. What are your thoughts on that? That's very specific, and I don't know how he got that, but... Just because of that, I think that we're going to win and beat them by 23. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. He's, he's a pretty good linebacker. I mean, he, yeah. could, he could pretty much, you know, make a big impact on this game. So you, you think uh, McCullum, CJ McCollum is wrong? Probably. Okay. And, you know, the Leopards are going to have to go up against um, an uh, All-American candidate and uh, Lehigh's defensive end, uh, John Simon. What are your thoughts on uh, them having to go up against him? Uh, I guess they just got to shut him down. I mean, the new coach has been, I, I think Garrett has been pretty successful so far in turning the program around. Um, I think there's been a change in the athletic department too. So I think when he was a defensive end, he was an All-American high school. Yeah. Okay. Well, just another challenge for the offense, I guess. I guess the offensive line really has to step up and you know <laughs> make sure they can protect their quarterback, freshman quarterback. Sean Combs, a linebacker from Lehigh, he guaranteed um, a Lafayette loss in the last week, uh, in the last game of the season, obviously, and and, uh, and he did it week one before the season even started. What are your thoughts on Sean Combs um, delivering the pounding message? It's disrespectful. Yeah. <laughs> so, so you think Sean Combs it, it will be wrong? Yes. Give me some numbers. Sorry. Twenty-three to zero. <laughs> I'm gonna go with 17, 14 Lafayette. 27, 20 parts. All right. 25 to 20. I'm gonna avoid the question and say there's gonna be a 14 point difference. 